Okay, we're back. And we're here to continue our foray into the submarine. You're not taking over the ship, actually, I think I am. Sorry, bruv. Hey, Restore leveled up. So I think that means that we learned Kiraga, right? It may not be mastered, though. And we'll find out in a little bit. <laughs> whenever we can actually move around. Oh, there's a save point right there. Perfect. I should have just waited until here to, to end the last part, but whatever. You want the sub? Just try and take it. Um, sir, maybe we shouldn't piss them off. Nah, they, they want to piss me off. It's fine. Oh, wow. A pincer attack. Alright, Red. You could... You could kill that guy, I guess. Uh, yeah. We got Cure 3, actually, is what it's called. Yeah, get rid of these guys, because they're pissing me off. Peace out, Cub Scouts. Shinra Beta. Now what the hell is that? There may be another piece of equipment, actually. It is. And it's shittier than the Shinra Alpha, of course, I guess. Um... Oh yeah, I was gonna check on the Restore. Uh, yeah, one more level and then it's mastered. Nice. Alright, let's fucking save real quick. I can also heal Cloud. Let's just use Cure, fuck it. Okay, now what is this? Oh, that's not a door, that's just a part of the fucking console. I thought that was like a uh, something to tell me to click at that red arrow right there. No, no, this is terrible. We don't have much time left, I don't want to die. There's still so much more I've got to do. I never even got to do my special victory dance in battle. Alright, then make this your first victory. Go on, show them. Yes, sir. Remember your last training. Begin! Yes, sir! I'm back, and now I got no regrets. Attack! Hmm. Yeah, let's fuck them up, man. They wanna fucking... They wanna be hard? We'll just use him as cannon fodder and get the experience. Yark! Captain, I can't hold on any longer. Let me show you how it's done. Yark! The special pose. And this fucking bullshit ass attack. Ugh, they got me. Pisao Biatch Shinra Biatch. Another shitty Shinra beta. What are they even good for? 
Alright, someone, please. I'm sorry, I can't take it anymore. What the fuck? The lack of space, the shaking, the roar of the engine? My legs can't budge it. Hunk of junk, just gotta do this. Why did Cloud just, like, have a breakdown? See? Now you take over. Hey, you're right. I do feel a little better driving. No sweat. Just leave everything to me. That was fucking strange. Alright. Well, now what? Uh, yeah, let's check out the manual. Submarine Operation Manual, Beginner's Edition. I am a beginner. Button placements. Directional. Up is descend. And down is ascend. So it's inverted uh speed up fire torpedo speed down all right i'll try and remember that mission orders presently on the ocean floor near juno a red leader submarine carrying huge materials being escorted by covert shinra submarine units furthermore it has been confirmed that several mines have been dispersed onto the ocean floor the ocean floor can only be monitored with shinra sonar radar screen Enemy subs can only be detected within the sonar area. Get in front of the detected enemy sub and lock on. Push square to fire the torpedo. The, the mines are found on the radar screen at the top of the indicators. The mines inflict great damage, so be careful. Uh, objective, sink the red leader submarine carrying the huge materia. Time limit, 10 minutes. Advice. <laughs> Get the enemy submarine in front of you. Concentrate attack on the red leader submarine. If you lose track of, this, of the enemy, push R1 and use your radar. Well, now what? Sit in that fucking seat, bruv. Everything seems set. We already read the manual. Let's go. This switch? Main screen on. Change the screen mode. Alright, well this should be interesting. I think it locked on? Shit, I just got hit. Uh, what? I didn't press that. The fuck? Oh my god, I'm taking huge damage. I did it though. I'll fucking take it. Mission complete. Okay. Okay. Received Shinra sub. Phew, we did it. The huge materia should be at the bottom of the sea bay, or the sea by now. Let's continue the search. All Shinra submarine units, do you read? All Shinra submarine units, do you read? Hmm, must be from Shinra. Report number two. We're submarine number two. Alright, I'll do it. This is Shinra number two, everything's normal. Roger. Your next mission is... Return to Junon Dock. We will transport the huge materia from the airport. Those without other assignments will report for guard duty. That is all, over and out. Junon Airport, we should make it if we hurry. Forget about the huge materia for now. We're climbing. The airport, no sweat. Okay. Not really sure why we need to do... Why are we just, like, fucking off? Seems strange. How to drive a submarine. Ba 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 ba. Perfect. Alright, we got the sub. Bub. Uh... Let's do a save. Because we were successful in that mission.
Alright, so now we gotta get to the Junon Airport. Don't really know why we give a shit. Let's see if we can rest up before we advance any further. Uh, this is a weapon shop, not the inn. Do you have anything interesting at least? Nope. Fuck it, we're just gonna go. It's not like we're really hurting or anything. I just heal Cloud. No biggie. Yeah, take your goddamn 10 gil, bruv. fuck do we get to the air? I think the airport's like at the other end of the, the town, right? Let me actually make sure. Because I really... I fucking don't remember. There's nothing over here, right? I was trying to avoid that, but whatever. It's through here? Yes, it is, actually. It's a good thing I fucking... Uh, I checked. I would venture a guess that this roulette cannon is weak to thunder. It certainly is. 1800 damage, holy shit. Peace out, bitch. Jesus Christ, this dude's doing a lot of damage to Cloud. Surprised this guy's not dead yet. The fuck? Alright, there we go. Hey, finally learned uh, his next limit break level. Damn. I guess we were trying to get on that plane. I don't even fucking know. Oh no, the huge materia. What? F we have three of them, right? Can we get to the destination before it gets there? Where's that thing headed? Rocket Town, of course. Oh, I guess that's why we were trying to get on the plane. I must have completely missed that or forgotten it. Whatever. <laughs> Okay, let's uh, get on back to the uh, airship. Oh, and I gotta set Red 13's um, next limit break level before I forget. Oh, I can't even go in the menu in the screen.
Uh, okay. Well, it'll be a waste of his limit level one. But it is what it is. Now, what is it? Attacks and drains the HP and MP from one opponent. That's pretty fucking good. We'll keep him in the party for a little bit. Maybe use his limit break once or twice. And then we could swap him out for Vincent. I think he's the next one. Alright, let's just heal up real quick. And save again. And, uh, well... Now that we have Submarine... We can do some more side stuff. So that's what we'll be doing. So the first thing that we're going to do is actually go to uh, the red submarine that we just shot down and collect the huge materia. I don't even remember what these are used for, for our purposes. I mean, I know what Shinra's trying to do with them, but I don't really know if there's anything that we do or learn want to go. I do want to go. Okay, uh, so for the, um... For the red sub, I think we need to, like, search in this area? And we need to avoid that thing at all costs, because it will fuck us up. I think it's, uh... Said southwest. So let's see. Holler if you hear me. Nope, that's looking pretty red. So this is the leader sub. Damn, makes me sick just thinking about it. Huge materia recovered. No damage appears to have been sustained. Phew, that's good to hear. And we got the huge materia, so I think that's three bits of huge materia, right? Alright, so next place is the Sunken Gelninka. Which is a very interesting area because it's a sunken plain that we could get to explore. I don't know how the hell you get to explore a, a, a plane underwater. I don't know how that works, but it does. So this is just what we're gonna be doing. I think you have to go this way. Oh my God, of course the fucking emerald weapon is right there. Dude, really? This guy's standing guard. Uh, X. Yeah, there we go. Yo, yo, bro, you're being real spooky, man. Let me keep my fucking distance. Alright, let's see. Uh, Alright, good, he fucking vacated. And I think he can also be there when you leave the plane. So... If you leave without saving, you can potentially get wrecked. This is the Shinra's Galninka type airplane. I wonder why it went down here. That is a grand question. First, let's save. 
So this area actually has, I think, a bunch of tough monsters. Um, we'll have to be a little careful meandering through here. But I think we're probably strong enough that we'll be alright. Right, let's see what's in here. Heaven's Cloud. I think that's a weapon for Cloud. Maybe, maybe not. Yeah, I was right. Alright, this one has six slots. Let's see what this one has. Also six, but no linked. And yeah, that's not gonna work. Fuck. Alright, well we can swap... Let's arrange these. We can swap these two. Yeah, these don't need to be linked. Okay, let's see. Uh, okay, these would be cool to have linked, but they don't... I don't really need added cut here. I can just put something else here that... Oh, like counterattack. Hell yeah. Alright, that's fine. All right, so first I think we gotta go through here. What is this place? Must be some kind of research establishment because there's a Mako generator. I think we gotta go over here first. This is an interesting looking enemy. Unknown. That's great. Tongue. Oh my god, that was so fucking strong. I hope that's a percentage attack and not just this base hit. Fuck. Nope. That's just his base hit. Fuck. Holy shit, dude. Is Yeah, he's about to die again. Oh my fucking god. Yo, holy shit, this dude is strong as fuck. And this is the only attack he uses. Oh my god. God damn. I might need to use Big Guard when I fight these guys. Holy shit. Bite. Finally, a different fucking attack. Holy shit, dude. He was like about to wipe. Oh my god. Oh my god. Real hectic. Oh my god. Not on Sid, fuck. Oh shit, I may fucking end up wiping. Oh god. I can't, like, revive my characters fast enough here. Holy shit. I wonder what level this guy is. He's... I can't. I just need to hope that this kills him. I can't revive my characters fast enough. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I got my first game over. It's a good thing I fucking saved. 
All right, I'll try that one more time. If I game over again, I'll just have to save this for later because he was really fucking me up there. Whoa. Yeah, I may be woefully underleveled for this area. Uh, you know what? Before we mess around with that again, let's just try to do this. Got a mega elixir, that's cool. This is another enemy that I remember. Unknown 2. Alright, I don't even know what this enemy did to the Sid. Didn't look like it did anything. Holy shit, look how much fucking damage he did! Yeah, there's no way that I can do this. Uh, area now. I, I can't do this. Holy shit, they are fucking me up. Yep. I'm not even gonna waste time trying to revive. He could just wipe me again. Oh wow, I survived. Well, that's cool, I guess. Escort guard? Alright, well, I don't know what that is, but let's check. Is it this? Yes, it is. Okay. That'd be cool to have, I guess. See if we could just get out of here. level are we? Yeah, we're kind of at a much lower level than I'd like to be for this area. I think you have to be around like level 50, ideally. Okay. Get the hell out of here. Yo, watch Emerald Weapon be like right outside the fucking sub. Thank god. Alright, let's uh... Let's just try and do the next thing. We actually need to go back into the sub. We're heading to Lucrezia's cave. Which is actually right by where we just were, unfortunately. I can't believe I was so underleveled for that fucking sunken Galnica area. Uh, oh yeah, duh, I should definitely have Vincent in my party. 
Alright, so let's, uh... First, let's check. Does he have a ribbon equipped? No, he has a Tetra Elemental. Alright, so you can keep that on, because I have three of them. We'll just be, uh... Taking all your shit. Sorry, Red. I know I wanted to see your, uh... Your limit break, but... I'll have to save that for another time. Now we actually need Vincent in our party. Come on, Vincent. Alright, do we have anything better that we can equip on him? I think the Winchester is about as good as it gets. Uh, anything better than the Escort? I mean, the Crystal Dangle? Um... It's actually not bad. Nullifies, nullifies all that shit. And this one also has, yeah. Yeah, let's go with the escort guard. Okay. Uh, we can pretty much just give him everything that Red 13 had. Uh. Yeah, screw it. Let's see how that goes. Oh, and he gets an extra one. Um... Oh, let's give him an enemy skill. Because you should totally have one. I do want to go. Alright, we need to get back down to the sub, and then actually back to the Coast of Del Sol area. Not that far. I'm really still shocked that I couldn't do that sunken Galnica area. Oh well. Okay, I think we need to go over here. A desert with a river nearby is what it says. Um, yep, that's this be it, I believe, and I think that's Lucrezia's cave right there. I wish there was a way to go faster. Oh no, it's actually a different cave. It's in the wrong fuck- Oh shit. That's the wrong button. Nope, 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 you want to turn around there, chief. Alright. There we go. I was wrong. This that, that wasn't Lucrezia's cave, obviously. Vincent. That voice, it can't be. Lucrezia? Vincent. Lucrezia, stay back.
no baby come back. Aw, rats. If she is happy then, I don't mind. I'm against it. Why experiment on humans? You and I are both scientists. I think it said humans, right? After that, a child was born to Lucrezia. That child's name is... Sephiroth. Oh shit! Lucrezia's fucking Sephiroth's mom. We don't know who Lucrezia is, though. <laughs> Whoa, damn. Just fucking shot him right there. <laughs> what the fuck? Erg. This body is the punishment that's being given to me. I was unable to stop Professor Gast and Hojo. In Lucrezia, I was unable to stop them. All that I was able to do is watch. That is my punishment. Lucrezia, you're alive. I wanted to disappear. I couldn't be with anyone. I wanted to die. But the Genova inside me wouldn't let me die. Lately, I dream a lot of Sephiroth, my dear, dear child. Yikes. Ever since he was born, I never got to hold him. Even once. Not even once. You can't call me his mother. That is my sin. Back. Stay back. Vincent, won't you please tell me? What? If Sephiroth is still alive? I heard that he died five years ago, but I see him in my dreams so often. Yeah, that dude is still kicking, and I know that physically, like myself, he can't die so easily, unfortunately. Please, Vincent, tell me. Tell me something good. Lucrezia, Sephiroth is dead. I think that's how you pronounce her name. It's either that or Lucretia. Alright, so we have to get into ten battles before we can go back in there and get our shit. I wonder if we can just get into battles here. We should be able to. I don't see why not. I don't want to have to, like, go into the, the sub, go back out, and then have to come back. That seems kind of whack. But I'm not getting into any fights here, which is a little disheartening. Oh my god, fuck off, really? I'm really gonna have to do this, huh? <sighs> Son of a bitch. What the... okay. Alright, R1 and L1 is actually to turn a lot faster. Wish I could, like, move faster. Okay. 
I think we can just park right here, right? Maybe not. I think there actually may be like a... Can you please just like turn this way? Is that not like the dock? Am I tripping? No, that's for the, the Junon ship. It has to be like an actual proper dock though. Is that it? Yeah, that's it right there. I knew there was one. We're moving? This is bad. Hoo boy, there's no way we can cross we can walk across now. Alright, well we're not we're not going to. <coughs> Peace out. Alright, that was a single battle. This may take a while, unfortunately. It is too. It's unfortunate we can't really do anything uh, around this area. I mean, I guess we could have tried to catch a chocobo or two, but we don't even actually own any stables. To do that to keep him in. So never mind, actually. Oh my god, he just straight up killed him. Well fuck. Alright. <laughs> fuck. And I think that was number three. <laughs> Big time yikes. All right, here we go, number four. A fucking gen? Jesus Christ. Get rid of this asshole, man. Keep picking on Vincent. Uh, you know, I'll just heal him outside of the party. Uh, outside of the fight. It's way more effective when you're not in battle.
I just got a free sample of a uh, cupcake batter that Megan is making, and it's do 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 damn delicious. All right, that was number four. Let's do number five. We'll be halfway there. Just another five. Sorry if this is kind of boring, y'all. Hmm. You know, I wish I wish I had like a story to tell or something, but nothing's really coming to mind. And I don't want to just ramble because that just sounds idiotic. Oh, you know what? Actually, I guess one of the things I can talk about is a, uh... Something optional that we probably won't be doing. Because I don't think... The thing that we get from it is useful. And what I'm talking about is the Speed Square and Golden uh, Saucer. I think if you get, like, 5,000 points in it, it's like a rail shooter, basically. It's really tough. Um, just because the PlayStation controls suck for it. Uh, but, uh, yeah, if you get, like, over 5,000 points, I think you initially get a weapon for Eris. Obviously, that's fucking useful, useless to us now. I don't even know what you get after, though, because I think you can only get that before the end of disc one. And obviously we're on disc two, so no use to us now. But one thing that's kind of shitty about it is uh, in every version of the game, except for the PC version, uh, you have to get the 5,000 points legitimately. But in the PC version, there's like a specific section where you can hit a target. I think it's like a zeppelin or something, and it like give just gives you five thousand points. What, what a bunch of fuck, honestly. Like the PC version is the last version that needs that shit, because you could. It's so much easier to just aim with the mouse if the game if you can configure it that way, which I'm probably sure you can. Whereas like here you got to use a fucking D-pad impossible. Well, it's not impossible, it's just a pain in the ass. Alright, I think that was number seven. Only three more. But yeah, it's a huge pain in the ass, and I don't even think the reward is, is all that great. I'll check it just to see what it is, but I'm pretty sure you get, like, an umbrella for Eris, which... I don't even know if it's a good weapon or not. It fucking better be. For all the trouble that you have to go through to get it. That should have been eight.
Nice. <laughs> All right, Unmas, and then we can get uh, this this stuff for Vincent, and then yeah, we'll call it a part because we're running over fifty minutes at this point. Okay, got stuck on the fucking corner there. Kinda sucks, we lost the fucking buggy because, uh... I think, I think there's like a, a functional limitation in the game that it only allows there to be two vehicles on the map at one time. Kinda whack. Thank God. All right, this should be it. How shitty would it be if I, like, descended, immediately got hit by the emerald weapon, and then he wipes my party. And <laughs> lost all that... the progress that I just had. That would be quite... disgusting. Yeah, so I wonder what's in that cave there. We probably need a chocobo to get in there, then. I swear to god, if I miscount it, I'm gonna lose my goddamn mind. Oh, I can't even run. Lucrezia received death penalty and chaos. Alright, so death penalty is Vincent's ultimate weapon. No materia growth, but very, very strong. And uh, chaos is his final limit break, so we got some time before we can put that to use. And with that, we can call this monkey apart. So, as always, it's been real, and it's been nice. In other words, it's been real nice. I'll see you next time.